Welcome to Ion Parenting. Today's topic is swaddling your baby. It's been around for thousands of years, yet still remains a mystery to many new parents. Here to explain the art of swaddling is Reagan Moya Jones, a swaddling expert and author of the book Swaddle Love. Reagan, good morning. Hi, thanks for having me. Now, I learned about this because I have a three month old, and when I was pregnant, I tried to steady up, but it's harder than it looks. Right. What is the secret of swaddling? I, well, actually, I would I would say it's actually not hard. It's uh -huh. just about getting used to it. And I'm sure now that your little boy is three months old, you find it's it's an easy thing to do now. I think the key is actually having the right thing to swaddle with. And a lot right. of receiving blankets are small and therefore, you know, not ideal for swaddling. Right, because let me tell you a secret. The first night alone with my newborn in the hospital, he was crying because he was cold. And the nurses said, this baby's cold, he needs to be swaddled, and I had to have them do it. There because you I go. watched YouTube video after YouTube video, but maybe I just didn't have... Well, no, it is. Right. When you've never done it before, it can be very daunting. But once you get the hang of it, you realize it really is just a matter of three or four folds, and you're good to go. But why do we do this? It's because the babies find it so comforting? Yes. Well, Although it can't be proven, it's believed that what it does is emulate being back in the womb because there's not much room in there. Mm -hmm. So, you know, when you wrap them up in a swaddle, they're nice and tight and secure and it makes them feel, you know, comfortable and, and as I said, emulates being back in the womb. Okay, well, let's do a demo. You can show me how to do it on our little model baby. Okay, great. So what you do is you start, and, and the key is truly a, a, a large piece of fabric. So mm -hmm. what you do is you start with a piece of fabric and you just fold it into a diamond shape like this. So that becomes the fold of the swaddle. Then you actually take the baby and you line their shoulders up with the top of the swaddle. Gently take their arm and bring the, the fabric up and over and across. And don't be frightened to pull it quite tight. You want a secure swaddle. So, okay. And you tuck it underneath the baby. Then you bring the fabric up, tuck it over the top of the fold and then you bring their other arm down across their chest, again up, pull the fabric tight, and then you secure the swaddle by actually tucking it underneath the baby. So as you can see, nice, secure, tight swaddle. Okay, that does look very comfortable. Mm -hmm. And now why, I hear case after case that the daddies are better swaddlers than the mommies. That is true, and I think that's got to do with the fact that they are stronger, and uh -huh. they're not frightened to actually sort of, you know, pull us stronger, and uh -huh. they're not frightened to sort of you know pull us stronger and frightened we sort of you know pull stronger and frightened you know pull stronger and you know pull 